Kazaki Show. I'm the Trev. Sweet. Anyway, unlike the Vancouver video, which was announced as I was going to bed, this one was announced as I was getting up. So I couldn't win either way. You know, one way or another, you were getting two videos. It was just how far in between this time they're both on the same day. But in the spirit of changing head coaches, <clears throat> we got another head coach on the way out. And this one, I think, needed to happen. Despite the fact of which coach it is. I mean, this guy doesn't necessarily have disaster seasons like this. But <clears throat> either way, after, after a blow loss to the Tampa Bay Lightning, which only extended their losing streak to eight games. The Flyers gave Elaine Vigneault his release from being the head coach today. Let's discuss. So Vigneault became part of the Flyers organization on April 15th, 2019. He replaced Scott Gordon, who was replacing Dave Haxtell on the interim basis. Vigneault came in with plenty of experience and plenty of success having previously coached in Montreal, Vancouver and for the Rangers and being to the cup final with his last two teams being with Vancouver in 2011 and the Rangers in 2014 so he had the Stanley Cup experience he's had how many division championships between Vancouver and the Rangers in his first full season with the Flyers, the shortened 1920 season, the Flyers had a very impressive 41-27 and 7 41-21 and 7 record, which was good enough for second in the Metro Metropolitan Division, but because the season was as wonky as it was, playoff success seemed to be not there as they lost in the second round to the Islanders, which we all remember this is the Islanders when they were good. When they were running the Cinderella bit. And that seems to be where success stops. I mean, unless you count Vino's 700th win earlier this season, or earlier this year, sorry, not this season, it happened last season, but this year. And after a 25, 23, and 8 record for the 2021 season, starting this year at 8, 10, and 4, including what became that eight-game losing streak. Flyers Brass said, nope, we're not going this way. And gave him the walk today. So in his two and a half, or two and a quarter season, sorry, the Flyers, he leaves with a 74, 54, and 19 record. So, definitely not Vino stats. I mean, definitely typical the way Vino seasons tend to go. Good for one, two, couple seasons. Near the end, it's completely plateaued. But with a team that has that, as, as much depth as it has, as much younger talent on its roster as it has, no reason they should be losing eight straight. Yeah, they're in a tough division, but there's no reason they should be losing eight straight. So on the interim basis, Mike Yao replaces Elaine Vigneault. You might remember Mike Yao. He, he used to be coach in Minnesota. He was coach in St. Louis before they won the cup. And personally, I don't think he's going to stick around. I think they're going to let him ride the season. They're probably giving up on the season at this point. And keep their options open and see what happens and who comes available at the end of this season or who's available during free agency, who knows? But I don't think Mike Yao is going to be their permanent head coach, and that's not a bad thing. So that was another one of Chess Hockey Shows. I want to thank you for tuning in. Don't think I don't appreciate the gesture, especially if you're at this point. It works out well for both of us. I keep saying that every time, and I hope you guys believe me every time. But either way, since you've made it this far, give me that like. Why not hit that red button that says subscribe all over it? We're three away from 100. Let's do it. Let's get there. Subscribe makes you feel good.
socials in the description down below. Moving forward, I meant to get to some projects and then got taken aback by coaching videos, but either way, I got to make content, so that's never a bad thing. But I do mean to get back to projects. So either way, in the meantime, and in between time, be looking for more videos from the Trev. Later.